Hello everyone, welcome to Salesforce Atlas. My name is Dorisa. If you're new to the channel, I really hope that you're doing great. And in today's episode, I would really like to share with you how to create a record that's part of another object and add it to another object. Let's say you're in opportunities and with few clicks, you would like to update your related account. And instead of going to this account and uh, opening their details page and finding the right field, you can do the same thing within your opportunity. Now, as always, I'm sharing one of my Trailhead playgrounds and I'm currently in the object manager. And if I go into, um, let's say, now if I want to create this another, uh, record page let's say in the opportunities and uh, I'm going to add another tab here and here as you can see we have details page that you can usually find on uh, on all records now we have this details page and I want to pull some fields from accounts and add another tab saying accounts and that then when I click on this accounts tab I want to have a collection of several fields. I don't want to pull all fields from the accounts record pages. Say sales managers or technical staff wants to have a quick way of updating fields within the same page. And um, I'm going to create for that uh, an action. Now I'm going to open my object manager, open accounts, actually it's right here. And as I want to pull this information from accounts, I have to create, uh, let's go into buttons, links, and actions. I have to create a new action and it is going to be update record action, object name. So the information and fields will be pulled from the account's record page. Action type is up update the record. So update our account record page and give it a name. Um, let's say for this one, I'll just have test. I will save this. You can check standard label if you want to add anything in here. I'm going to save this. And on the next step, we're, we will have a page layout. And here you will select the fields that, are, that should appear uh, in the opportunities. Let's say if you want to update the industry very quickly or update their phone number as you're working on a new opportunity, something has changed and you want to quickly update the phone number. Um, it can be um, anything else. Maybe it could be their address. Let's say a billing address has changed. I'm going to add it in here. What are some of the other options? We have account site revenue let's say account annual revenue i'm going to click a click save now this action is ready now i'm going back to the user interface i'm refreshing the page and from here i want to edit the page so click edit page now our lighting app builder is opening and here i want to add a new tab which would indicate that you can find as well some fields from our account page within the same opportunity. And we can see here on the right hand side, all available tabs. We have activity details and chatter. And I would like to add another tab that would probably can't really find the name here so i will select custom and name name it good a name account and now you can see i have here new tab now i'm going to select this new tab and i will be looking for related record drag and drop related record now i want to find update action first we have to select the right lookup field and we don't really want to use the same opportunity we want to pull information from a different object now i'm going to click edit lookup field and i will be pulling from the account name 
we have account name, click done. And let's see, yes, as you can see, I only have in this environment one update action and it has automatically pulled the right action from the account page. And that's the page layout that you saw just a few steps ago. We have account name, revenue, phone, billing address, and industry. Now let's click save. You can also add any filters if you don't want to apply this across all opportunities, but make it very specific. You can, yes, you can hide it. And now I'm going to click save and that should be ready. I'm going to activate it. Assign is org default for desktop and phone. Click next, save, but that's only in my case. It might be different in your environment. And I will, let's see if it has saved. I'm just going to save it again. And now I can go back and I am still within the same record page. I'm in opportunities. And if I click on accounts, I have here this account page. And uh, this is giving me an opportunity to stay within the same page and uh, make any changes that are required. You can quickly make these changes, click save, and then it will also update your account. All right, so let's save this new phone number and let's go to details, click University of Arizona. And let's see if the new changes have applied. Yes, as you can see, phone number is just, it's exactly the one that I've just entered to the system. And uh, I did it through the opportunities page. It is a really great way of updating your parent record uh, without actually going to that parent record uh, and selecting the right fields. It's really easy, very simple. And uh, I hope you'll find this useful. And thanks a lot for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.